Is your brand on Instagram? Well, we're gonna show you five Instagram tips from 10 of the world's biggest brands. We're gonna look at Warby Parker, Whole Foods, Coca-Cola, Virgin America, Starbucks, Nike, Samsung, TripAdvisor, Chobani, and American Airlines. I'm Josh Oaks with MediaLeaders.com. First of all, let's give you the tips right up front. First, your Instagram story should complement your brand. Next, encourage your fans to post photos and to tag your company in them. Third, consider featuring your employees. We're gonna show you real examples of this. Four, mix business photos with fun and helpful pictures. And number five, we're gonna show you how to use hashtags to get your Instagram account discovered, to tell a story, and we'll show you how to find trending hashtags. Now, tip number one, your Instagram story should complement your brand. And that means consider choosing photos that will get your customers easily connecting your brand with an interesting story. Let's take a look at TripAdvisor real fast. Here's their tactic. Post beautiful photos from around the world and consider using quotes in the image from real users that have complimented you. As you can see here right in the middle, I travel because I am still amazed at what I find around the next corner. These are images with text embedded over them and their brand subtly put in the bottom. Now let's take a look at Chobani, the Greek yogurt company. They post healthy breakfast options, various recipes, and lifestyle pictures, which include their yogurt. And they're using their story to complement their brand. Now let's take a look at Old Spice. They use humorous pictures and videos that men would find interesting or funny. They're talking directly to their target audience and using their story to complement their brand. Let's take a look at Virgin America. Virgin America has a unique style and color. You won't mistake it with any other airline. They're using not only their colors with just about every picture, but they're having a lot of fun. A tip number two, encourage fans to post photos and tag your brand. This is a great example and a great chance to engage your product users and your brand fans. You can encourage them to post pictures and include certain hashtags or your Instagram username. And that's our favorite, by the way. Including your Instagram username in a campaign gets you more followers. Then, and here's a little tip, you can repost the best of those photos on your Instagram page while giving credit to the author. Now here's an example from Starbucks. Starbucks posts the best of their fans' photos in which the company was tagged, and they add a hashtag regram and the fans' username in the caption. And you can see here lots of different photos of real people sending them in. Now here's another example from Starbucks. Someone who gets you hashtag good things, hashtag regram. These are real customers having a good time with obviously Starbucks cups in the picture and they reposted it. Now GoPro, the camera company, encourages its followers to compete and every day it chooses a photo of the day. And as you can see here, we've circled photo of the day and they include the actual people in it taking a break on the way and they're having a good time taking an actual with a selfie stick an instagram photo next you've got somebody here photo of the day father and son fun to get this shot these people wore a quick clip on the bill of his hat and the wife triggered the burst mode using the gopro app so they're having fun with family showing consumer using their product and they're also describing how they took the actual photo Let's take a look at how Coca-Cola encourages fans to post photos and tags their brand. Who said eggnog was the perfect holiday beverage? Not us, hashtag holiday cheers, thanks for the pick. And they include the username. Next, thanks to this person for the photo of Coca-Cola on the town. Now this is where it gets genius. They're buying a bunch of billboard advertising and they're using social media to take pictures of their advertising, but technically they're tagging users that are taking pictures of their advertising and they're listening on social media. Great job, Coca-Cola. Let's take a look at Warby Parker, the eyeglass company. They tag somebody and they say, this person fights off the cold by trying new sunglasses and dreaming of white sandy beaches. Warby Parker does a great job, by the way, and here's another example. Regram from our friend, this username, wearing his new Warby Parker sunglasses. Who doesn't love a picture of a dog? Now let's take a look at Expedia and how they're using Instagram. Lunch with a view, yes please, and they include the at username of the person that took it in Italy. And they took a picture of not only them traveling, but enjoying something really specific while they're traveling. Good job, Expedia. Next, they tag somebody in the, in the beginning, 
hitting the slopes in hashtag Whistler Canada. What's your favorite? And they ask a great question. A who, what, why, where, when question happens to be a great way to finish off a message below an Instagram picture. Now here's tip number three. Feature your employees whenever possible. Post photos of your team members. Your followers appreciate having a chance to look behind the scenes of your business. And moreover, customers like to see real people who work for a company. Now, here's tip number three from American Airlines. They post a lot of pictures of their team. People are always smiling and that creates the feeling that if it's a good company to work for, maybe it's a great airline to fly with. You can see different photos here of real people behind the scenes and a regram of DFW Airport looking back in time now let's take a look at Warby Parker. Warby Parker posts photos of the company's employees wearing their glasses and they do this in an incredible manner. And if you take a look at their Instagram account, they have photos from all over the world from users and they're doing a great job. Colin of our employee experience team wearing these kid frames along with having a lot of fun at the office. Next, Virgin America features its employees and thanks them for helping their brand to be so successful. And they have a lot of fun with it. They have a lot of humor in their Instagram photos. Now here's tip number three, featuring your employees from Whole Foods. They describe their team members as amazing. The company shows how proud it is to have its employees at the center of their customer service experience. And they describe them as amazing. As you can see, it's a busy and sometimes stressful time of the year. You'll find our amazing team members ready to help you throughout our stores. We think, say thanks to all of them. Here's tip number four. Mix business photos with fun and helpful photos. As with any other social media network or platform, be careful when posting too many promotional photos or selling on Instagram. Try to entertain your followers instead and inspire them with your pictures. Here's an example from Samsung. Samsung created a separate Instagram account for its camera. Now most of the pictures are beautiful and professional photos of places and moments taken by their cameras and customers as you can see. Here's an example from Bonobos. Now Bonobos promotes not only clothing but a lifestyle. Photos display a fun and active life that men want for themselves. They're not trying to sell their products, they're trying to have an aspirational side that you can see through their Instagram account. Now let's take a look at Coca-Cola and how it offers its customers a new way of using an empty bottle. How clever. They get crafty. They say save your memories from 2015 in a hashtag happiness bottle so you can look back at all the happy times. Hashtag New Year's. Four different photos and ways to get clever with its product. Nice work Coca-Cola. Now Warby Parker, back to them again. They're having a lot of fun and they play up the idea of wearing glasses sometimes is associated with being smart and reading. Warby Parker offers its followers the list of companies' employees' favorite books. And they have that list here, and they have a little link in there. Good job, Warby Parker. Now, Virgin America has a great sense of humor, and they post photos that would make their followers smile. Here's a good example. Happy hashtag Thanksgiving. You are now cleared to put on sweatpants. Very smart. Next, they take a picture of a baby airplane and put it in a hospital as if it was just born and they call it Runway Angel. And their message says they are so cute when they're small. Hashtag TBT. Throwback Thursday. And this is as if they just got a new airplane and they're showing you a picture of when it was born. Now, Nike doesn't just promote their clothing, but instead an active lifestyle. And they're doing a great job at tip number four, as you can see here. They're taking an active lifestyle and they're showing that people that are active are wearing their shoes or their clothing. Now tip number five, and this is a big tip, consider using hashtags to get your Instagram account discovered. If you've read my first book, you know that I do not like hashtags on Twitter. I think that they're too much. But on Instagram, they're pretty important. And the number of hashtags you use depends on really how big and popular your brand is because big brands usually don't use hashtags or they use very few, mostly those that they've started for themselves or for fun. Now, however, if your company is new, it can be very helpful to add a few hashtags to get your pictures discovered. In this case, use at least two hashtags. BufferApp.com shows that 11 hashtags are typically the most effective. Here's a tactical tip that we found, and you'll hear this first here. Find trending hashtags on search.twitter.com and then consider going over to Instagram.com to use those. Search.twitter.com is going to be your friend on the desktop. It also works mobile. 
All right, now here's an example of tip number five. Restaurants, cafes, clothing stores, and other smaller brands are successfully using hashtags to reach new audience members or tell a story in the hashtags. And you can see these people right here. Angler Restaurant, Saturday night is tasting menu night. Pig and Eel course away. And they have hashtag angler, angler restaurant, all these different tiny hashtags, food art, foodies, and all this different fun stuff. And next, pin up girl clothing, saddle up to our new saddle shoes. They've got a bit of an old school clothing thing going and they have hashtag vintage, hashtag OMG shoes and all kinds of different stuff. And they're having a great time with it. Now, here's our tips once again. Let's review. One, your Instagram story should complement your brand. Two, encourage your fans to post photos and tag your company in them. Three, consider featuring your employees and your team members whenever possible. Four, mix business photos with fun and helpful pictures. Number five, use hashtags to get your Instagram account discovered and tell a story. Now, I wanna give a shout out to Anastasia in my office for doing a lot of the research for this. You're probably asking, what should I do for the next steps, Josh? Well, click on number one to see our favorite marketing tools and products that we use every day at our agency at medialeaders.com. Click on number two to learn about our favorite books. We get old school and buy real books on amazon.com and you can see everything we're reading. Number three, watch 250 of our marketing videos on our website and you can go learn a bunch of our tactics. And number four, subscribe to our channel by clicking on number four. I'm so thankful that you're here. I'm Josh with medialeaders.com. Thanks for watching this video all the way to the end. You're awesome. As always, keep it light, bright, and polite. Have a great day.